hey, don't forget to subscribe to Mums at the Table. I'm sitting here with Rach talking about algorithms. It's a term that's thrown around online. You may have heard it, you may not have heard about it. What is an algorithm? Well, I wish I could say I was this math genius who knew all about it, but I know about it from a very top-level understanding. But algorithms are basically what's ruling our world right now. Right. And you can think of it in a very simple term, something that even I can understand, as just a set of instructions. So if you've thought about baking a cake before, anything that has a set of instructions, it's something in a very basic level like that. And it's okay. these instructions that we're giving to computers. We're telling computers, this is the set of instructions that you need to know to carry out this task that we're asking you to do. So it's important for mums to know what an algorithm is is because... Yes, that's a great question. Why, why is it relevant to us? Yes. Well, it's relevant to us because it can help you control your online experience. Um, when you're going on social media, you're getting suggested different ads, or even when you're um, going on Google and you're being suggested different things as well. How can you control your online experience? I, I, it's so interesting that you say suggested. I feel like my phone stalks me. <laughs> I feel like you know, you'll have a conversation with a friend, next thing you know, it's all in your feed. Is this something to do with the algorithm? Yeah, so there's lots of stuff happening behind the scenes that we may or may not be aware of. Right. As we're going to websites, they're dropping little cookies and dropping like just a little piece of code onto our um, computer and just kind of signaling the types of things we're interested in. Right. They even know sometimes when you're scrolling, if you hover a long time over a particular yeah. um, article that maybe you're thinking about that or you're hesitating wow. because you're having some psychological response to it. So they're even measuring all of these things. And this is being used to create this profile about you that's then signaling mm. to, you know, websites and things about how it's so interacting with you. So they are stalking us. Yes. They are stalking us, whatever that is. Yes, whatever that is. Are, yeah. And, you know, I think it's interesting because there are these debates around who rules these algorithms because whoever rules the algorithm kind of rules the world. We've seen this in various presidential elections, not yes. just in the United States, but around the world, that these algorithms are being um, used to help, yes. you know, people make other people make decisions. Mm. So I think as we're going through life, we're trying to help our kids navigate this online world. We need to know how to navigate this online world yeah. for ourselves as well. Do you think, I know there seems to be a negative part to it, that they're stalking us, they're just, you know, giving us what we think we need. Yeah. But are there good things to algorithms? I mean, there could be as well, because, you know, you may not want to go online and have, a, you know, hear about V8 engines if that's not what right. you're interested in. So basically it's creating these personalised, customised experiences for us that... Filtering out the stuff you don't need? Exactly. But I think the important part is just to understand that there is someone behind the scenes kind of making some of these decisions. So being aware, understanding the bias that might be there. Mm -hmm. But as we walk into this brave new world as well, as we're having autonomous cars, and all these other technologies, um, the algorithms are getting smarter and smarter. We're using technology like machine learning yeah. where the algorithms are teaching themselves. So just knowing these words and having an awareness can help us feel more confident as we walk into this new technological world. I guess it also helps us to be more cautious or mm -hmm. mindful, I guess, when we're looking for things and searching things, knowing that they're probably going to flood us with whatever it is you're searching, whatever yeah. it is you're interested in. So, yeah. The more you know. The more you know. Doesn't help, doesn't doesn't hurt to, to know more, I guess. So yeah. there you go. They're all about algorithms. Now you know.